Welcome to the Santiago Project. With all the music and performing arts programs being cut or minimized, most future musicians do not have the resources. My goal with the Santiago Project is to provide those services and products. Hello, my name is Viviana Fernandez, and I have been a music teacher in Guatemala for the past 15 years. Hola, mi nombre es Julián Rodríguez, de Medellín, Colombia. We're here to support all music educators and future musicians. Today I want to thank the Santiago Project for granting me the scholarship to finish studying. Fundación Santiago Project para recibir la beca, el curso de dirección con el maestro Tomás Berrer en la Universidad de Vanderbilt. We have partnered with Thomas Verrier, who is the artistic director at Vanderbilt, to make it possible for anyone all over the world to participate in his classes. My name is Peter Gomez, founder and president of Think One. My family didn't have the resources that most families did. If it wasn't for my music teachers moving me and guiding me and uh, motivating me, I don't know where I would be today. I grew up a son of a farmer. In my family, all the summers were spent working on the fields. Needless to say, I relied on the support of my music educators to pull from their own pockets to help me with my music journey. I think it's about time that we can all help them out now. With the Santiago Project, we can actually make donations so that we can manage all of those music educators and help these students that could be the best musician in the world one day. Everyone in the corner is my friend. We are going to take that gold medal to us. I am like the biggest extrovert now. Go to SantiagoProject.org and make a donation and change someone's life today, as my teachers did. Mr. Russell, Mr. Smith, Mr. Saxon, Mr. Nicolosi. It's, it's really hard for me to get through those names. Sorry. Oof. They moved me and touched my heart so much. After a while, it's your students, it's your teachers, it's your friends that motivate you to do the next part of your life. And if it wasn't for those guys, I probably wouldn't be here today. That's as far as I can go right now.